Hello everyone, this is Uzma here, and I'll be presenting the upcoming Lumiapedia for Darko, the 74th character of Eternal Return. Lumia's Lone Shark uses a bat as his weapon to ensure his debtors pay on time. He threatens them, steals their stats, and overpowers them in close combat. Darko can move where his enemies are to break their position using his R skill and weapon skill. This makes him an effective bruiser, excellent at taking control of engagements. Now, let's check out Darko's skills. His kit consists of his Q, Lone Shark, W, Got My Money, E, It's Paytime, R, Intimidation Tactic, and finally, his passive, Sly Thief. Passive, Sly Thief. Darko performs a basic attack, temporarily stealing his target's defense. Darko's passive, Sly Thief, gets triggered by basic attacks at regular intervals, temporarily reducing his opponent's defense while increasing his own. Since the effects of this skill are applied as a percentage, there will be times when Darko needs to unleash his Sly Thief nature against the opponent's tank. Therefore, it's crucial to apply this skill to the right target at the right time. Q, Lone Shark. Darko's movement speed increases when he moves towards an enemy character. His next basic attack deals additional skill damage and leaves a mark on his target. Darko's main attack skill can cancel the action of a basic attack to accumulate damage more quickly. As an on-hit, it can also trigger the passive skill Sly Thief and any item skills on top of his basic attacks. Using this skill on an opponent marked by this skill significantly increases the damage dealt, so it's crucial to use it effectively. W. Got my money? Darko gets a shield that absorbs damage and slows enemy characters nearby. He gains an additional shield per enemy test subject hit and steals their attack power. Additional shield and attack power can be obtained from up to 4 test subjects near Darko. Darko gets shielded based on the number of enemy characters he hits, up to a max of 4. Since the amount of shield he gains and attack power he steals depends on the number of enemies hit and not their stats, it's important to hit as many enemies as possible. E. It's Paytime. Darko dashes forward and slams the ground, dealing skill damage and knocking enemies airborne. Darko can dash to a designated area, knocking enemies airborne, which comes in handy during quick engagements and is useful for going over obstacles as it enhances his mobility. R. Intimidation Tactic. Darko grabs the enemy test subject as he moves forward and then slams them to the ground. Enemies nearby take skill damage based on their max HP and are slowed. This is Darko's most important skill, so listen carefully. Darko can use this skill to momentarily reposition his opponents, like moving the main dealer from the backline to a more vulnerable position. Or, he can use it to grab the enemy tank and bring them closer to your backline, dealing significant damage and serving as an excellent initiating skill. It wouldn't be Darko if he wasn't taking something from someone. His ability to steal stats from opponents always tilts the battle in his favor. Master this character, and your enemies won't even see your sly tricks coming. Learn his skills, set up fantastic initiations, and lead your team to victory. That was it for today's Lumiapedia. I'm Uzma, and I'll see you on the next one.